Uh oh. Yes, it is. Recast news. You just get this notification. Unless they oh Grace Randolph. Oh <laughs> bullshit. Bullshit. What? Grace Randolph mm-hmm. tweeted. Unless they start Black Panther 2 over from scratch, and they're not going to do that, it's too late. The movement has gained real momentum lately, though, so maybe we can get a T'Challa variant. I fully support the fans behind Recast T'Challa. Shut the fuck up. (laughs) Shut up. Dead ass. Is she replying to someone? Nuh-uh. Yeah. It's a thread. Here's an idea. Let's not map every single moment of Doctor Strange 2 like Spider went. You are the... Oh, that's rich. Your voice is important to the comic book community. Please support Recast T'Challa. Unless they start Black Panther 2 over from scratch, and they're not going to do that. It's too late. The movement has gained real momentum lately, though, so maybe we can get a T'Challa variant. I fully support the fans behind Recast T'Challa. What? Well, that timing is incredible. Shout out to JP. What the fuck? What Yikes. the fuck? Yikes. I'm about to light her ass up. So, Grace Randolph, obviously, we're not a fan of her because she constantly comes out and says ridiculous bullshit against Recast T'Challa, the movement. Has just recently tweeted to today it looks like unless they start black panther 2 over from scratch and they're not going to do that it's too late the movement has gained real momentum lately though so maybe we can get a t'challa variant i fully support the fans behind recast t'challa really really so i i i I don't we we must have passed the threshold for filming for disney um, so they, they took the handcuffs off of her and allowed her to speak her own mind. Why, why, why not, why not six months ago? When you, you said it, silence? you said it wasn't going to happen six months ago. Yeah. Now here we are and you talking about, oh, it's too late. It's, it's, it's disingenuous. It's disingenuous. And if you, even if I were to believe that you have genuinely come in, come around to the, to the idea of recasting, which is not far fetched because many people have. Many people have. Many people didn't know that you were planning on not having the character in there at all. Not a lot of people didn't know that you planned on having a funeral scene. A lot of people didn't know that you planned on having an anti vaxxer as your main character. A lot of people didn't know that you were planning on having some weird religion swap honoring fest. In this movie, a lot of people didn't know just how bad of, of, of a script this is turning out to be. Well, considering the six or seven rewrites, at least. Yeah, I um, with, with, with Grace Randolph, it just it just feels disingenuous. It does, because. You never gave the level of appreciation or deference that was needed for your platform to be properly introduced to the concept and then when it permeated your 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 audience anyways that's the funniest thing man i have not found a single thread john campia comic back comic book cast two uh uh behind the trailer new rock stars I have not seen a single thread in any of those, these videos where people are telling us about whether or not they're going to recast a child where the dominant thought is don't recast. There's several people in there who try to note the 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 um, the Reginald Hudlin run with 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 Shuri and do it incorrectly almost every time. There's a few people that feel like retirement is the only way to honor. I believe those those people are mistaken on the, the, the definition of honor, but it's their opinion nonetheless. Mm-hmm. And then the vast majority are either very, very grief stricken about the loss of Chadwick, but still see the importance of the character or full on know that most of the grief talk around Chadwick Boseman is B.S. It's bull. Mm-hmm. Either 
We have a huge problem in the understanding of how to deal with grief in this country. Possible. Very possible. Or you're liars. Because taking something that you miss, stick it in a box and putting it in a closet forever does not stop you from missing it. Taking T'Challa away from children in future generations is not going to make you stop missing Chadwick Boseman. That is not a rationalization for not recasting. And even if it was, it's selfish because that's you. We talk about representation as, as, as a thing that affects millions of people. Black, white, Asian, Jew, Gentile. You are talking about something that affects you personally. And the fact that people use that so readily and so confidently. I could just never see an actor get into the role. It's Chadwick's role. You sound extremely selfish and nonsensical. Meanwhile, a lot of people are talking about who's going to be the next James Bond. Guess it's fine to give the black girl the black IP, but she cannot have a white man's property, can she? She cannot. Because we, we need to lose our shit over that. Yeah. I, I just feel like now we're at a point where kind of where we were at with Spider-Man No Way Home this summer. We didn't know the exact plot. We didn't know exactly how things were going to come about. The one thing we did know is that all the Spider-Man villains were going to be fighting three Spider-Men that we have known from years past. Mm -hmm. That is the one constant thing that they couldn't get away from and that we know. We're at that same spot now with Black Panther 2 Wakanda Forever. However, we, in this case, it's a negative thing. It's yeah, a positive exactly, thing. Yeah. exactly. We know you're going to kill T'Challa. We know you're going to send him off in, in some sort of funeral scene. We know you're going to attempt to elevate a new Black Panther to the mantle. We know it. So dealing with that information is going to set the table for your audience reception right away. Let me ask you a question. Mm-hmm. And, 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 I'll, and I'll be honest, I mean, this is probably the least likely of the scenarios. But is there any wiggle room in here for you where they could be deep faking us? I, I, I think it's very problematic to take that route with us. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Because it, it, uh, it, you're, you're, taking, you're taking some risk here when you start talking about perceived discrimination or hostility mm -hmm. because how do most businesses feel that not obviously in their pockets but what we've seen over the last two summers how do how do most businesses feel the wrath of black people when they've been wronged how do most businesses get 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 they show up they protest mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you really think Disney wants a nationwide spree of protesters showing up to movie theaters? No. That'd be even worse press than what they're getting now. It would be absolutely awful press. Yeah. That's terrible. There are 55,000 people all over the country who want to see something happen. You have basically given them the middle finger and told them to sit down as uh, without as so much as is as, as acknowledging the concerns around it. Which is all based in, in I mean, those people are mostly black. So how how again, I, I pose the question, I, I asked you the question and I tried to answer it my damn self. How do you think that there's any wiggle room for this to be a deep fake and we end up getting a T'Challa of some sort, whether that be a variant, the original character? A deep fake in the sense that, like how they tried to do with Spider Man and and try to hold off announcing everything until the last minute. Mm -hmm. Do I think that that's uh, no? I I don't for Black Panther two at least. I, I think recasting is still a I guess a possibility for Black Panther three, but it would almost require them to have to take Black Black Panther two and set it pre blip, and even then there there can't be a funeral scene. If they're recasting via variant. But even if it's pre-blip, Shuri got snapped away too. She got dusted. Yeah. So how is she in this movie? Yeah. It, 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 it would be impossible 
for it to be pre blip. It's got to be post blip. Mm. If we're defined, if the blip is when Hulk brought everybody back, and the snap is when Thanos made everybody disappear, this movie has to come post blip. Yeah. It has to. It would have made all the sense in the world to make it pre blip, given the circumstances. Which makes me believe that, again, this is so much more about retiring that character and that image than it is about Chadwick Boseman. Chadwick Boseman renegotiated his contract to be on for Black Panther 3. The MCU's plans included Black Panther because he made it that way. Because he made it that way. How are you so set on honoring someone but so unwilling to replicate their effort? Somebody going to have to explain it to me, man. Somebody going to have to explain it. I think this movie's coming out. It is going to come out. Mm-hmm. It's just not. It, it's going to be a wreck. And that gives me. That makes me nervous for the franchise's future. Because yeah. I, I think this could end up being one of the one of the worst like we talking Thor Dark World level. But they wouldn't stop Thor because he's a mainstay, at least for the Avengers. They they would stop. Thor is going to have his fourth movie coming up here in 2022. Fourth movie. And, he, and there's going to be two Thors in the movie. One, the original protagonist of the story and the newcomer mm-hmm. and, the, and the gainer of the mantle. See how easy and seamless that is? You get to elevate your female lead into her rightful position while it being handed down from the stronger male or the 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 strong male who had been there before. Elevating her, validating her, supporting her, defending her. Give us your your thoughts and reactions below on everything. Uh Shoot, Winston Duke, uh, Gloria Randolph. Oh, yeah, Letitia Wright taking her shot. (sighs) She's going to have some explaining to do on Fox News. Facts. Facts. Boy. (laughs) Give us your thoughts below. And make sure you check out our Recast the Child playlist if you haven't done so already. We like to talk about any kind of upcoming news that we get about uh, Black Panther 2 and, and the situations with Recast T'Challa. And make sure you subscribe. Like I said, we like to talk about this quite a bit.